we were supposed to have a civil ceremony this weekend or today and then we we talked to you know my parents and like um family priest and he was like why not just get the church wedding over with already i mean you know at least god's grace will be with you guys already everything is set and i thought about it well my it really sucks that like my my family can't be here <sighs> it's facetime i want to see you here i'm calling you on facetime oh my god you look so gorgeous you look gorgeous thank you well, you're, I feel like you're hugging me now. <laughs> <laughs> you look amazing. Thank you. I want to hug you. Can you give me a kiss? Yeah, you will. <laughs> Stop crying. <laughs> Today, we are gathered here as a community of Christ to share a blessed moment in the life of Anton and Sophia. As they offer their love for one another to God and ask Him to bless their union, let us thank God for this moment and pray that their life together as husband and wife may be full of experiences of faithfulness, hope, happiness, and love, and ultimately be a journey towards Him. I've told you this before and I will tell you this again. Anton, you are my biggest blessing. You are my answered prayer and you are my dream come true. I really cannot ask for more. I know our relationship was never smooth, but really you have always been a true and steady partner to me, especially in moments when I felt like giving up. <laughs> no, a journey that started five years ago has now come to this point where we become one. What a ride it has been. An end to calling ourselves single to a new beginning of our marriage life. <laughs> <Bye>. <laughs> Sophia, did you come here before God and this community of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your husband? Yes, Father. I feel utterly blessed and eternally grateful to spend the rest of my life with you. Anton, did you come here before God and this community of your own free will to bind yourself forever in the love and service of your wife? Yes, Father. It may not be as easy as we think, but I will accept this challenge and take this ride with you. Alright. <laughs> Are you both ready to love and honor each other as husband and wife for the rest of your lives? Yes, Father. Father. Anton and I were talking about it, but you know, it just it's about us at the end of the day. This wasn't our perfect setting. I mean, I'm with someone that's perfect for me, and that's really what matters. Like, it's just between us and God, and this is just the beginning. I love you, and I can't wait to see what God has in store for us. For us. Let's make this meaningful and memorable. Cheers to us. Love, and love. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> I, by the authority of the church, calling all those present here as witnesses, confirm and bless the matter of marriage which you have contracted in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. I know, me too. 
<laughs> but I doubt you will ever forget the road to this day and the immense strength and love you've built and continue to build on for the rest of your days. Thank you for showing me what true love is and how to share it with everyone.